Gray here today. I'll talk about what Zur has this week. Of course, today is Friday, January the 21st. Zur is located, uh, of course, on Nessus up here on the tree limb. Today's inventory for Zur is not too bad. Of course, I'm here on my hunter. Always make sure that you guys come in here and check each individual legendary piece he has on each individual character that you have to make sure any of the rolls are really good. The hunter's rolls this week on the legendary gear are not that great. When it comes to the exotics this week, we have the Telesto Fusion Rifle. We have the Stomp EE5s, which are rolled with a lot of strength. So I'm not sure if a lot of you will be interested in that or not, but these do give you buffs to sprint, slide, and jumping. They're a very good pair to have. Uh, a lot of hunters like these in PvE and PvP content. When it comes to what we have here for the Titan, of course, it's the Worm God Arms. These give you melee kills, increase melee damage. These are rolled with high mobility and resilience and intellect. So it's not a bad pair because it's got some pretty good numbers across the board. And then last but not least, we have the Phoenix Protocol. If you like to run uh, middle tree solar on your Warlock, this is an absolutely wonderful uh, chess piece. I use mine all the time. The only thing I don't really like about this one is it's 15 strength, 15 intellect, and 14 mobility. This would have been a really great chess piece if it would have had more recovery and discipline, in my opinion, for the way I run my build. But this might fit uh, the way you'd like to run your build. So make sure you check these out. Uh, of course, this week for the legendary weapons, we have the Draw Sidearm, which has triple tap and elemental capacitor. The seventh Seraph sidearm with fill prep and snapshot. The Night Watch with threat detector and explosive payload, which is a really nice roll if you do not have a good Night Watch just yet. Plus, of course, we know next season Scout Rifles is going to be one of the overload uh, champion weapons. So that's definitely going to be, or at least one of the champion weapons. So that's going to be a great one to have. Also, we have the shotgun here with the pulse monitor and snapshot. We have the toll and trouble shotgun with fill prep and rampage. Uh, we have the grenade launcher here with fill prep and threat detector and the stars and shadows, which we had just not long ago this week. It has outlaw and head seeker, which may be better than the last roll. I'll kind of have to look and see and compare these compared to the last stars and shadows I bought a couple weeks back. Anyway, guys, that is what Zer has on offer this week. Of course, like I said today, January the 21st, leave me a comment with your thoughts. And of course, if you like the video, hit the like. If you have not subscribed yet, please do so. Be sure to check out everything down in the description, the community discord, my Twitter, and of course the affiliates here on the channel, Empire Jerky and Amazon Associates. Also check out the merch store that is linked in the description as well. And I'll catch you all next time. Peace.